The unofficial depth chart, the first one of the year, came out. Let's look at the defensive side of the football and a, a lot of familiar names and some new ones. Uh, yeah, you look at Jackson and Billings as the tackles, Clowney and N. All those guys new this year. Uh, Greedy Williams was injured last year. John Johnson the uh, third and Anthony Walker, all listed on that uh, top of the depth chart. So Dan, um, you look at the linebacking core and Taki Taki and Mac Wilson uh, listed as the starters. Especially Mac Wilson, that was a guy that some thought was kind of on that roster bubble, but. How well has he performed thus far in training camp? It's really a credit to both of those guys that they've come in and taken advantage of, of their opportunity. And Mac Wilson, especially with Owusu Kormo going on the COVID list, Tony Fields, you know, hurting his foot again. It was, it's actually the other foot than, than what he hurt in the spring. So, you know, I, I think Mac Wilson deserves a ton of credit for showing up. You know, he's, he's really kind of transformed his body a little bit. He, he shaped himself a little more the way the, way the Browns want him to, to be, you know, I don't know what Mac Wilson is ultimately. I don't know if he's the guy you want starting at linebacker, but I think he's certainly proven in this camp that he's a guy that uh, belongs on the football field. And right now he, he deserves to be with that number one group of linebackers. He's earned it.